everyone! Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a salt painting. This is a really simple craft which is good for all ages, especially young kids who are just learning about colors and textures. All you need to make this craft is a piece of paper, cardstock works best so that it can hold up with the glue and the salt, uh, some paint, the best paint is watercolor but you can also use a watered down tempera, salt, you want to make sure it's white salt, white glue, um, that you can actually pour out of the bottle to draw your design in paint brushes and water. All this craft is, is a layer of glue in uh, whatever drawing you want to make, a layer of salt, and then the paint itself. So simple, easy, quick. Let's get started. Our first step is to draw our design with white glue on our cardstock. Now you are going to sprinkle some white salt over the image and you want to sprinkle quite a lot of the salt to make sure it coats your thick white glue. Here we go. Now you can shake around the paper to make sure it's distributed. And now you can shake off the excess salt onto here and make sure to save that salt for the next time you do this craft. Once you've sprinkled all your salt and you've shaken it off, now you're gonna leave it to dry. Make sure that you take maybe a paintbrush and brush away the salt that you don't want maybe in the finer areas. Um, and before it dries, you can also take a paintbrush and just brush off the excess salt that's in the middle. Uh, so this is going to need uh, a little while to dry. You want it to be completely dry, so make sure you uh, touch it with your fingers uh, before you start painting to make sure it's ready to go. Okay, so I've let my glue drawing dry all day. You might want to leave it overnight to make sure it's completely dry. And when you think it's done, make sure you shake it a lot so you get all of the salt clumps off so that they don't stick to your paintbrush when you start painting. So now I'm going to show you the method for actually painting your salt drawing, your salt blue drawing. And the first thing you're gonna need is of course paints. Watercolor paints do work best for this craft, but you can also just water down your craft paints, your tempera paints, um, into the caps. So now I'll show you what it looks like to apply the paint to your glue salt drawing. product. This is what it looks like all dry and ready to go. Some other fun ideas I would recommend for design is maybe writing out the name of yourself or your child. They can put it on their door or a special spot in your house. Another fun way that you can use this activity is to teach how colors mix. If you have some primary color paint like yellow and blue, you can show how they make green. Uh, by just dropping the colors into the salt and they blend really nicely. So there you have it. I hope you enjoy and have fun.